is a little video uh, just to show you um, an exam interesting example of ecosystems at work here. Um, so I'm standing next to a little quince bush and uh, the little red and or I guess orange and black critters you're seeing there are actually ladybug larvae and the little spots you're seeing are uh, aphids. So ladybugs as you probably know are predators. Aphids as you might know are also uh, considered pest insects. Um, but without your pest insects there is nothing for your predatory insects to eat. So in an organic farm or garden uh, what you want to have is ecosystems. So essentially letting nature work for you um, rather than constantly uh, working against it and trying to correct any problems that you may have created uh, for instance by using insecticides. So um, what's going on here is the ladybug larvae uh, are cleaning up the uh, little pests, the little aphids. Um, another neat thing, if you can find it uh, underneath this leaf is something else kind of fascinating. Um, can't quite see that very well. Uh, basically what we have here are ants. There you go. Uh, you can see that a little better. Small ants, little sugar ants that are actually farming the aphids. So what uh, what they're doing, um, they provide protection for the aphids um, from the ladybugs and uh, in exchange for that um, the aphids excrete a uh, basically a honeydew um, really high in sugar uh, that they're uh, basically you know, transitioning or excuse me excreting from the sap that they're sucking from the plant um, and then the ants get a nice little meal out of it uh, but the eventually the ladybugs a lot of times will come in and uh, end up taking over their the aphid livestock from the ant from the uh, ants so you can see that going on here um, this is actually a ladybug that's about to become the larva uh, different stages so egg um, larva pupa and adult so this is one that's uh, transitioning from larva to pupa and there are a bunch of adults here here's some more some more larva there we go there's an adult so essentially we have a little ladybug factory and the ladybugs will once all the aphids once all the food source here is exhausted uh, they'll move on to other areas of our garden and provide pest control for aphids and other little little critters so Again, one of the cool things about being an organic gardener is you get to see all this, uh, these different things and get to kind of be a steward of these ecosystems.